Ladies, gentlemen, and you beautiful in-betweens, hello and welcome back to MechWarrior 5 Reloaded. I'm Computer, and last episode, I got this beauty. It's another hunchback. We do have this old one here, and it has three auto cannons. Uh, let's take a look at that, actually, now that I think about it. It's you. So we see here... Uh-huh. That... Uh, Destroyed weapons and or equipment times five. Doesn't look like it, and I can't repair anything. Destroyed equipment, though. Oh! It has energy slots. I could just put that in there. Don't want to, but I could. I could also replace these with, let's see, tier 2 AC5s, burst fire. But yeah, this bothers me, that it, that it has destroyed weapons and or equipment. That probably means that something was destroyed, and instead of fixing it, I just removed it, I guess? And then didn't do anything about it, unless... That's odd. That's not how that should work. Going max armor would actually just go up to the max tonnage, not do anything else. But, um, yeah, let's, let's skip that and go back and see what's wrong here. There's destroyed equipment, times five. Uh, maybe it's a couple of the heat sinks. I know I put that in, that in, and the reinforced legs. I think I put those in there. Also, this might be overkill, honestly. You know what? Maybe this is just some kind of a visual bug that will be fixed by me going into a mission and coming back. Maybe. I don't see anything wrong here. I might be blind, but I'm not seeing anything wrong here. I do see a thing wrong with the head armor. But I'm gonna leave it. I do have a reinforced cockpit, so there, there, there's hope for this guy. Anyway, this guy, though... Let's take a look. Large laser, weighs 5 tons, medium weighs 1, damage 8.4 at a rate of 12 RPMs, or rounds per minute, so it shoots tw uh, roughly 12 times per minute, so that's, oh, I would really like, like something like a DPS or DPM, damage per minute counter or something, because this is 5 at, okay, so this does about 3.4 damage less. Wow. Okay. No, I, I, I was just kind of thinking like maybe I would want to replace a couple of the medium lasers for another large laser. That's clearly not a good idea though. And large energy slot pickups as well. Uh, back in there you go. And zero, zero, good. I could replace it with a large pulse laser as well. 9.9 .9 at roughly 15 RPMs? Uh, and heat is 6.75. Heat here is 5.7. Right? Uh -huh. Yeah, I kind of want to put that in there. Except I have to lose the two medium lasers and they give me plus 10. And this only gives me plus 1.5. So that, that would not be a good idea. Uh, and we have an LRM stream, you know, like 10 stream, which I do like. Oh, interesting. Uh, if I do something like this, four. And if I put in a six, that's cool. It actually does... Uh, that doesn't seem like 20. Am I not seeing something right there behind it? No. 
Nope. Uh, let's put you back. I'm sorry. Right, also, uh, yeah. Uh, 15 looks... Okay, so LRM 20, uh, 15, and 10 all look the same, apparently. That's disappointing. Uh, eight days. Um, did I have that one there then? No, eight days two. Yes, it was a tier two. Uh, and then stream. Okay. Uh, right. Um, what else can we look at? We can look at me. I have an. Okay. That might not be a good idea now that I think about it. I'm technically going from an AC 10, 11 at 22.222. Okay, uh, and you are 6 at se 75 RPMs, though. But if I keep shooting it, it's going to jam eventually. I'd actually rather put this in the hands of a capable NPC pilot. And let them uh, like decide when to use the weapon so that it never jams, or probably never jams. That might be up to like pilot skill though. Nine tons, twelve tons, yeah. Let's. Although I kind of want to use it just once. Where did you go? Oh, oh right, that makes no sense. Also, it's a really rare weapon. And I honestly don't want to put it in an arm that I know I'm gonna lose eventually. Uh, and I also don't want to use a burst fire. Ten days. And we're over ton. Uh, strip. Why does it do that? Uh, when I strip armor and then max it, it should just go up to the max tonnage. But, uh, oh well, it, I guess it doesn't, and you're not Max at all. Uh, oh. want to leave this up to me. There, and now we add some more there. And go back. You're already down. It's... Why am I protecting you so much and not my reactor? I really dislike that it doesn't do that for you, but uh, what can you do? What can you do? Also, I put in a load of double heat sinks last episode, so that felt nice. SRM ammo, yes, good, and... Oh, no, 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 no. Good thing I caught that. And we get 40 rounds with that. And UAC was 80 rounds. There we go. Can't believe it's one ton. It's a single heat sink. One ton. Okay. That. Okay, so it just takes up more space. Got it. Uh, yeah, 36 days. But I'm already at. Damn it. I don't want to wait. I'm going to play with the. Uh, no, no. Let's keep it. Let's do that and give our UAC to... Uh, can we actually do that? Large ballistic slot, yeah. Oh, 
Oh, um, yes. Because we haven't actually dismantled this weapon, I can't actually put it in another mech yet. Well, that sucks. Uh, and it's so long, too. I really want to do this now. Ah, okay. That felt like a waste of money. Uh, uh, let's waste some more then. No, not you. I would like an explanation for why you can't do this. I mean, it is valid. An AC. Huh? Yes. That's really odd. Yeah, you don't have any. Okay, well, I, I guess I'm not going to do that then. Come on back. Confirm. Yes. And you are still using AC5 bursts. Good. And we have our hero make right there. Never going to use that. But he's part of the collection now. Anyway, I look forward to seeing if this is a beast or not. But now, let's actually do a mission. In the wake of recent raider attacks inside our territory, a wave of refugee... Wait, how's Merrick? Target house Leo. Okay, good. Uh, in the wake of recent raider attacks inside our territory, a wave of refugees fled to for their lives into Liao territory. House Liao is now refusing our people open passage back to their homes, claiming ongoing security concerns. In truth, we suspect they're trying to destabilize our region of space. And also, they probably just want to torture these people. You can play at that game. We want you to send a message to Liao by assassinating the local governor where the refugees are being held. Um, I think you're escalating the problem a little bit too much with that. But we get to fight in an arid canyon during light atmosphere, what uh, like means maybe a light drizzle. And it's noon and we're fighting House Liao. And it's a campaign mission. Difficulty 25. I'm not sure if I'm concerned about that or not. I clearly could do uh, difficulty 27, but this is a campaign mission, and I don't think that Reloaded can mess around with that. And because, well, no, we get six points. This is a mistake. I should probably have done a few missions for them first to get the salvage share up to 11. 11, across the board, see? Yes. Tonnage 200, that's good. I'm still concerned that we're escalating a little bit too much. Uh, House Liao can be troublesome. Uh, especially now that it's Maximilian that's in charge. He was quite the psychopath. Then again, so was... Uh, Marissa, I want to say? No. Maybe. Uh, Kilpatrick has no mech. Yeah, yeah, you... Wait. Who here has... Oh, you have... Good... Ballistics. You have good lasers too, though. Or better lasers than you have. And you probably will use your medium lasers more. Yep. It still bothers me! Really? Like, I can't tell what's actually wrong. Uh, maybe it lost its arms? I'd have to go back and watch the last episode. I'll go back to a previous save game just to see what, uh, like, uh, state it was in when I got it. But, yeah, also, two. Mm, well, that's gonna go up a lot. Unlike this guy's. So, yeah. Easy twos. 
Right, right. Uh, I'm ready. I think. What's her name actually? Marissa? Or was it? Something with M, I think. I really need to reread re the books. Attention. Prepare for Battle Mech departure. I really love the design of the hunchback. Don't point that at me, please. Thank you. Reactor online. Hello. Sensors online. Weapons online. All systems nominal. Okay. One shot, one kill, Commander. If only it were that easy. Yeah. And here I thought you were as good as your old man by now. Not quite that good. Give them hell, Commander. I'll see you on the other side. Yeah. Let's take a look at this. Yeah, they're all dead. In this universe, they don't have, um, like dampeners or inertial dampeners, is what they're called. Oh, you're all the way over there. We do have some kind of a city thing here, or town. It's... Yeah, I'm not going to bother with that. I've wasted enough time here. Let's see, what else can we look at? That's all good. I forgot to do that for the hunchback. I hope his pilot can figure that out on their own. That's a lot of weed. Sorry. And then my friend is walking right over it. Yeah. Of course. I try to be nice. And my subordinates really just don't get it. Target acquired. Yeah. Thank you. New target acquired. Target is in the field, Commander. They're marked on your tactical display. Right, we have no concern for civilians here. I'd say so. Oh wow, um, that's what you get to fight. you guys my back but if you don't leave these or rather if you do leave these guys alone they can bunch up a lot uh-huh Oh, 
Other than that... Oh, Kilpatrick is almost... Wow, did I not... Uh, I should probably tell him to leave. And he is in one of the hunchbacks? Did I not... No, I, I, I definitely did fix him up with armor. Is that you? Oh. New target. Minor target, Commander. Destroy. Unit squad taking heavy damage. Destroy. Whoa, there's a. All right. Um. Kilpatrick's mech is definitely damaged. A lot more than it should be for Hunchback. Yeah, something's weird there. Uh, that's... Alright. Normal enough. Oh, no, never mind. It's Javelin and Locust. I'm gonna take it anyway. And value-wise... There's not a lot to look at couple of machine guns. Nothing much else. I'm gonna take you. No, I can't. Another 15 is three shares. Interesting. Guess I'm gonna stick with you then. And just sell the javelin and locust. I still wish I could hover over these to see what they're actually, like, what their condition is. On the other hand, it kind of makes sense that you'd be kind of buying the pig in the bag. That's a Swedish expression that I don't think translates all that well. Um, basically, you're just given a sack and told, there's a pig in there. Do you want to buy it? And you don't get to look at the pig. But it, yeah. Um, holy wow. Wow. Well, I mean, technically, I probably... Well, these are probably going to be halved. Or halved. Uh, so... 1 point something, uh, 1.7, 6, no, 1.8. I'm dumb. Uh, so, I mean, I do kind of... I'm just going to keep going here. Kilpatrick? Yeah, I mean, you didn't actually, or maybe you did. Wow. Hmm. Well, you did level up your skill there, though, so that's great. And so did you. Uh, something here is wrong. Something's fishy. Right. I never even looked at what kind of a mech the governor was actually piloting. Or mech warrioring. Excellent job, Commander. That should put Hao Ziao on notice. Now let's see how they react. Hopefully the refugees are already on their way home. I doubt it. But the political situation is highly volatile, volatile, so there's no telling what might happen next. Either way, our payment is for this our payment for this job just came through. So the drinks are on me tonight. I'll see you on the bridge. And we got some more potential sea bills and some more reputation. Now let's take a look at uh, you. Wow, you lost a lot. Um, God damn. Did they alpha you or something? Sheesh. People just have. Uh, is it a good idea to place these with tier twos? If come on, if he's going to lose them like that, was it a? Maybe it was because he wasn't a new mech. Maybe Peril still says it has de destroyed weapons and equipment. Actually, he says destroyed weapons and equipment. That probably means there was some medium lasers in here. 
Let's see what happens if I put in... Yeah. Yeah, okay. That's... That doesn't... That only adds five. Uh, if I do something like this... Hold on. That's odd. What's going on here? Internal heatings four. Why? Oh yeah, I, I, I pressed, literally pressed, like, strip armor. Sorry, yeah. Oh, mm -hmm. What's going on? How does this not take up any weight? That makes absolutely zero sense to me. Something's wonky with this. Also, it's incredibly under... Like, even if, if I do... This and this. Checking... Yes. <laughs> 76 days. Yeah, yeah, I, I think that makes sense, actually. 74 days? Uh, this is actually fine. I'm... Uh, well, now that you don't have anything in there... could actually do this. And... maybe just give you... That seems kind of pitiful now, actually, now that I think about it. Component lost. A lot of these were hurt. Maybe that's because he lost his arms. And that transfers some of the damage into the torso. That would make sense from a weird kind of perspective. I'm going to test that theory and give him some armor on the arms. Maybe I should give him some uh, reinforced arms too. No, no. 74 days is enough. Right. Uh -huh. And then we get to fix you to repair all. You didn't lose anything. Good. Uh, yeah, you need to be repaired. And that also means... Reinforced arm... Uh, reinforced arm skeletal structure and more efficient armor plating reduces damage taken due to incoming fire by 10%. Applied only to the component it is equipped in can be stacked. But if I have, like, literally zero armor, probably it's not going to do so much. And I'm also going to test a theory on this guy. Nope. That's enough. Thank you. 12 days. Got it. And then you. They're all good. Uh, and you have a machine gun. That's great for you. Heat sinks and no, oh, and no. Okay, so he got a cord. That's good. How about you? Oh, it's an SRM one. 
So it's our own book. And it has an each. Wow, that's cool. Could do a lot with that, actually. Kinda don't want to. Yeah, I'm just gonna sell it. Should probably not sell it here. I have insufficient fun to buy a locust. Could buy another armor mech, though. I mean, that gun is basically bigger than the entire mech. And equipment-wise, I don't want to buy any of that. Right, home. Uh, oh, speak to... Okay. Guess I could. Forgot I wasn't up there. Oh boy. Uh... Yeah. Kinda messed up, aren't you? You are the least hurt among us. Smart pilot. Probably smarter than me anyway. Which is to... Stings kind of to acknowledge that, eh? because it's an AI. Okay, Commander. I work Hello. for House Marik is not quite finished. I've been informed Good. that House Liao have retaliated because of our actions against the local governor by launching several military raids on Marik border outposts. The good news? It means another payday for us. House Marik wants us to hit back by destroying a military logistics center belonging to Liao. They're hoping to hobble Liao's military capabilities in the border region and, in doing so, convince them to back down and allow the refugees to return home. The thing I find extraordinary is that House Marik is not going after Black Inferno. It was their egregious actions inside Marik territory that started this whole thing. Instead, they're focusing all their anger and resources on House Liao. If I had to guess, I'd say someone very powerful is behind Black Inferno's actions, and that whoever it is, they're using that power to shield these bastards. As to who that benefactor might be, or what their endgame is, I don't know. Still too many questions, and not enough answers. For now, we have a contract to fulfill. I've prepared the mission briefing. Once you sign off on the op and get us where we need to go, we can launch. Copy that. Sounds good. I think probably it's just because they're mercenaries, just like us, technically, even though they're quote unquote evil. And uh, they probably have connections in House Marik then. And uh, the person inside House Marik really just doesn't want to. Uh, lateral damage doesn't pay all that well. Uh, yeah, that doesn't want to sacrifice this mercenary unit that they're... Or merc no, this unit that they're close to. Maybe. I can see some political reasons why it's... Uh, this is what's happening, but yeah. Um, actually, do I know if House Liao... That was a glitch. Yeah, do I know if House Liao actually hired Black Inferno? I mean, their morals would probably align well with each other, so that makes sense, but uh, let's not prejudge. The logistics center si sits inside one of House Liao's urban military complexes. The building's housing... Uh, oh, the building's, plural. Housing the Logistics Center are mission-critical targets and must be taken out in order for us to get paid. Beyond that, the Merrick li Liaison has put no restrictions on collateral damage. So do whatever needs to be done to succeed, Commander. You have free reign on this. Uh, uh, I don't like that. I mean, it's good that they're not going to protest if I shoot down some civilian buildings, but... Yeah, just but 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 uh, Capola. How long's that gonna take? Thirteen days. Intel says House Liao. Yeah, House Marik. Yeah. Griffin. Uh, we can have a an identified mech, an identified mech, trebuchet, Kintaro crab. Have I fought a crab? Probably I have. 
another hunchback, Shadowhawk. Nothing above 50 so far. Well, there was a 55, yeah. Blackjack, nice. Turian, Javelin. It would be both fun and frustrating if something like ultra rare is a hundred ton mech. Just to see what it's like fighting one of those guys with the current lands. Anyway, uh, can you see anything interesting around here? Black market? No, thank you. Assassination contract. We have a rare mech all the way up there. I do like how they're... Interesting that lines, like, fade in. Anyway, I do like that they have these, like, uh, conflict zones and that they, like, open up more and more of the map so you can fly around to your heart's content. I never really realized that the Capellans had so much... Just so much space. Or maybe they lose a lot of it later. I don't know. Let's actually start to travel. Yes, thank you. We have a couple of contracts, but 40. Oh, that might be a... Mm. As long as Kilpatrick knows what he's doing. Also, I kind of want to sell... There's a markup. How much do I actually get for them? Oh, a little under half. No. Um, I'm to see you, I can see Tadra. Wow. Time no see. Also, yeah, where's Tukayid? Uh, oh, wow, now this place opened up too. Cool. Is there a search function here? No. That's why I do recognize that. Epsilon Eridani is. Outreach! Cool. I, I know someone on Reddit asked if, like, uh, you could attend the. Uh, go to Outreach and become a gladiator, etc. I forget if the uh, the answer to that was yes or no. Would be nice if you could. Nah, I'm not seeing it. I'm possibly blind. Anyway, apparently we are supposed to... Yeah, destroy a bunch of stuff. There's cannon, how's the oil campaign? Six still. Uh, 40... That gives me pause. Maybe I should stop campaign missions for a bit and like just wait do more missions for house Merrick and get it up to nine at this point on the other hand because it's nine i can tell possibly that i'm going to encounter smaller mechs maybe on the other hand it does say like rare oh, three mission operations mm, ADD, stop uh, on the other hand, it did say uh, when, on the intel report that you could encounter up to 55 mech ton, uh, ton mechs. Anyway, yeah. I'm concerned with that uh, difficulty rating. Let's uh, fix you. Thank you. Thank you. 
And yeah, so next episode, possibly a campaign mission. Maybe, yeah, I could do that. Um, I could play some uh, just Housemaric generic missions between episodes, and then we get to the next campaign mission next episode. That sounds like a plan. Not a good plan, but a plan nonetheless. And so with that, ladies, gentlemen, and you beautiful in-betweens, I've been Computer, this has been Mech 5 Reloaded, thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time.